Bobby, first off, a 1 0 win away to South Shields tonight in pre season, so just a must be delighted with that performance. Yeah, another good, solid performance, played some really good stuff at times, and then, you know, you expect to come here and not have the ball, and when we didn't, we, we were in really good shape and pressed them when we needed to press them. Yes, they got out a few times and had a few opportunities, but. It's what pre season's all about. You know, we're gonna we'll pick the bones out of it and if it, you know there is things we can work on and we'll do that. But overall, you know, really good workout for us and I'd like to think it was a good workout for them. Um, but you know, we're not getting carried away by anything as pre season and you know it's just nice to get the lads out there on a lovely surface and playing some nice football. Yeah, it must have been really refreshing as well to and I know you have been working on a lot of fitness and you know, for the first ten, twenty minutes I think uh, we, we dominated this game, so we really pleased with that. Yeah, it, one of the aims this year was to control games more, whether we've, you can't do it all the time with the ball. So we've worked on a lot of stuff pre-season, be, you know, being fitter so we can press when we need to press and be in shape when we need to be in shape because no one has any right to control 90 minutes of a football match. So there'll be times where we're under the cosh and we've got to you know, be ready for that. And the lads you know, shown that for majority of the game tonight when we didn't have the ball um, but you know just really pleased overall um, we've got more minutes in the lads that probably needed some more minutes and a few lads back from holiday that will get more on Saturday Yeah and you're starting to see a few partnerships form and at the back obviously Matty elson has been back for a week now so he, he's played alongside Jack Donaghy um, you know, I'm our up top as well with a few wingers alongside him so is that really nice to see? Yeah competition for places makes everyone hungry and um, we've got that yes we haven't got the biggest squad but when you've got some of them young lads backing the senior players up it's just pushing everyone along and you know there's a real you know I can see it in there there's a real you know like it it's a quiet desire I can see it in them and we've just got to go about our business we're not gonna like I said we're not getting carried away pre-season but really pleased um, minutes you know, clean sheet, people defending really well when they needed to and, you know, some of the forward play was brilliant. Yeah, and Spruton was about one youngster in particular, Ryan Hardy, he got an assist tonight. Um, obviously, he got a goal on Friday as well, so he's came off the bench and looks all confident at the minute. Yeah, he's a young, energetic player and, you know, I can tell you from experience that as, as a defender, you don't want a young, energetic, direct, very good footballer running at you. You know, if, if, I can imagine in the last 20, 30 minutes of games he'll hurt teams. So it's nice that he's playing with a bit of confidence and not coming on and going into his shell and being a bit worried if he, if anything goes wrong. But they've been brilliant, all of them. You know, some of them have gone back to the 23s just to train and get a few minutes under the belt. But you know, I can't you know say how proud I am of the club really of how they've looked after them, obviously in previous years to where they are now so it's a real good it's an advert for the other children and, and you know boys and girls within the, the pathway that there is a opportunity for you know for them to progress yeah and you said you're not getting carried away with tonight's victory but you know having a win mentality so early on in pre-season you know you're breeding that into the lads so is that just a positive tip yeah you know obviously you, I'd lie if I didn't want to win every game, whether it's pre-season or five-a-side, you know, or the FA Cup final. You, you want to win every game, um, and it's some. You know, I've mentioned that one major thing in there about what I want them to do this year, um, and they've started to do that for me. And it's you know, it's good. It's a good feeling in the dressing room, but again, I've told them in there that. They keep the feet on the ground. Do not get carried away at all. It's, it's, it's just a, a process of what we're, you know, trying to get to to August. Because I guarantee that game will be totally different to the game that we play on the 12th of August. Yeah, you haven't had a training session in nearly a fortnight, and you've got one this Thursday now. So do you start integrating things like the lads? Yeah. Well, we've worked on stuff before the game started. We've gave some, you know in match instructions what we want people to do and you can see it starting to fall into place a little bit and it, Thursday gives us an opportunity especially after a tough game tonight to you know walk through a few things and go steady and ready for Saturday which will be 
you know, another tough test for the lads. Yeah, and just can you elaborate on, on the plans for Saturday? Are you expecting to, to vary it with tactically or is it going to be sort of the same type of game plan between the two games or what? No, well, the lads that didn't start tonight will start on Saturday. You know, that I think it's only right that the lads get to experience, you know, playing against some top sides, one tonight, who, you know, who have been brilliant in fact, you know, looking after us since we've come. Really good side, really, you know, know the staff really, really well ran and wish them all the best. And then Saturday, Saturday be exactly the same. Two sides, one that's, you know, bringing in international players and one that should be, you know, top end of the National League North. So it's, it's our fair to the players where I want them both, both sets of players, you know, tonight and the one on Saturday to enjoy themselves and be able to go on a enjoy themselves and compete against teams of that level.